All right, day four. We got a little cold start this morning. Alrighty, we are back on the road once again. From what I understand today is gonna to be a lot of interstate driving, which I'm not really looking forward to. So we're heading to Hebron, Ohio. I think National Trails uh, drag strip. So that'll be pretty cool. Maybe see some drag racing and stuff like that. But I think we're just going straight up. Uh, I think 71 is the road through Cincinnati and all that. So it's gonna be a long day.
right now and my truck's starting to kind of intermittently do the same thing i think it's that coil again man i don't know so we're pulling into a little rest area right now and i'm going to kind of check it out but it seems like it's doing the exact same thing it was doing the other day so i do not know what the heck i mean that's a hundred dollar coil right there so that sucks pretty bad yep it just died on me that really sucks. I got a day out of that thing. So we changed out the new coil on here. Uh, this isolator here for your carbon pickup. Uh, me and Brent got to reading on the instructions a little bit and we actually were supposed to put this dielectric grease on this pretty liberally they said so we did that this time and hopefully that'll help out a little bit more all right we got the coil i think fixed you think we should fire that thing up real quick to make sure that's what it was <laughs> so you think we should fire it up at least to see if that's what oh, it yeah. actually was yeah i mean i think it was but Yep, sure enough. So we're gonna address these tires. You can see it's a little slicked up on this one. So we're gonna tow these in a little bit. starting to pull a little bit to the driver's side now that we've adjusted that. Is it? So I'm probably, I don't know, figure something out. I'm trying to think what I need to do.
hopefully between those two things we can make it to the venue um, yeah like I was saying I might just end up putting that module in this thing that way we don't fry another coil really don't feel like spending a hundred dollars a day on a coil that would get pretty expensive pretty quick it already has but yeah we're rolling nonetheless it's kind of cool we uh, made this little stop because we're gonna uh, forward <laughs> we're getting to uh, kind of check out a little small town which is my favorite part of this whole thing so far so we're rolling though See what we can see. For a special treat, not only do we have your friend of mine, Shay Garrington from Iron Resurrection, hanging out, pressing the flesh, we also have a couple of special guests up here. Uh oh, gotta get the seat yet. Yeah. Sit down, I want yeah. you to take a beer. He's in the
Ray's got 14.7, I got 12.0. They're bumped in, ready to rock. Just ran by the Holly booth real quick to see if anybody would know what's going on with that MSD system and nobody seemed to have any idea or never heard of it. So yeah, I guess if anything happens, we'll just continue on with our other plan that we were talking about. So man, it's weird whenever people will just look at you and you're talking to a daggone phone. <laughs> oh well, onward. So just hung out with yeah buddy rusto mod and dewey speed shop check all them out on here they've all got some great stuff but i'm walking back over here now and i think we're about to wrap this up for the day all righty we're rolling out gonna head back to the hotel room you know the deal we'll probably go get something to eat and then hopefully we'll see some burnouts in the parking lot or something like that Let's do it. currently waiting on everybody to come here for dinner which Jay and Jackson are just rolling up right in front of the camera but I just overheard somebody right behind this fence saying that somebody just broke a window and uh, is in broad daylight trying to steal stuff I don't know so that makes you feel pretty dang good
Well, I'm not gonna lie to you. I just laid that thing out. Somebody lit a firework off. I thought, <laughs> I didn't know what. I thought I landed on something or I don't know what. Lord. About to go into an epileptic fit here in a second. <laughs> but I'm gonna walk around here real quick. See if Brent and them are out. I see the Cobra is underneath this little awning here. So it looks like they found a pretty cool spot for it. But not much happening here tonight. I don't know if it's at the other hotels where everybody's hanging out or what. So, see what's going on. Alright, so we're supposed to get some rain tonight. I'm going to try to put these cups over top of this thing. Real quick. I know it's not going to get into the engine, but it fills those exhaust pipes up with water and then it's going to blow it all over the thing, so I'd just rather not have all the soot and everything sprayed everywhere, so if I can keep it from doing that, I'm going to try it. I'll cost to dump it out. So I just talked with Jay and He's at his hotel, which is like right across the interstate or whatever. So he's pretty much just going to chill there for the night. I think everybody's kind of just down and out and kind of tired, including myself. So I think I'm actually going to get this video edited up and hopefully uploaded in the same day. So that'll be kind of cool. Won't have to stay up till one o'clock like I've been doing the past couple times. I do want to say thank you if you are a new subscriber because I've got quite a few this week thanks for hitting that subscribe button and all the love that the power tour videos are getting we've got one more day to go it's gonna actually be a pretty long day for me because not only am I driving to Indy tomorrow but I'm driving from Indy down to the southern tip of Indiana where I currently am living so I guess I've always lived there I don't know why I said currently but anyway yeah hopefully you enjoyed this one it was a pretty good little trip, even though it was interstate. <sighs> it's been a long week. We about got her now, though. So tune in for tomorrow. Hit that subscribe button so you can get the little notification whenever I post it. But we're going to do it. We're getting that long haul plaque. It's going to happen. It's like I'm in a daggone horror film with all these lights flickering behind me. All right. I'm going to bed. I suggest you do the same. See you.